Hey folks, welcome back to Ostrov. Just looking at the town from a different perspective. This is that last neighborhood that we had put in. And yeah, it's kind of a nice view from here. Anyway, um, we did finish last time with a failed trade from Balaklia. Or accidentally sold them 4,400 and... 58 clothes that we don't have so yeah it's well are we coming in now i think we are yeah i don't know how they're going to explain this to them but uh we'll just we'll just watch it happen you roll in here someone no one <laughs> nobody wants to give them the bad news okay well Krilo is going to uh, get the, the duty, apparently. Yeah, he's going to check in. He's going to give him the 200. The other guy's going to say, um, what? Um, excuse me? It's supposed to have been 1,000 here. Yeah, yeah, the boss messed up. Yeah, mm-hmm. Okay. So, with that, these guys, Boatyard, uh, we are hauling one over to repair. And you are set up. Let's set you, let's try this a little bit differently. The first two months and the last two months of the season, you guys can try to repair boats. And off season is zero. Okay, so you're doing that. You guys are here. Um, one boat's being worked on. And where are they actually? You're in a boat. You are on your way to work, and you're on your way to work. Okay, dude, work quick. Someone's coming. Someone's going to need that. We're over here. We're fine. We're all functioning, and we're all coming to work and getting ready to go catch some fish. Okay, just kind of recapping. Came up in the comments about the small granaries and how you know folks have been moving in, and it's possible that uh, other items could have shown up and should they be hired to buy them and what have you so i got to thinking this is a source of income for the ladies down here and there's quite a few ladies now and not a lot of sources of income for them so i'm going to go ahead and leave this running except for the two months a year just to give them a salary our budget's doing pretty good right now so i'm not going to be too worried about that um we're still plowing before because we're in march before everybody who's been laid off is is going to jump in and get to planting fields. Otherwise, they're busy doing other things. I see our loggers are, are busy bringing a log in from the bridge. So there's still a project happening here, the lime works. There's the other half of the log. Okay, so they're working on that. And I assume the other ones... Well, this is the next tree chopping job to do, but it's not the next one in lines. I don't know if they're going to go to it or not. Um, what are you guys doing? You are working and working. So you guys are just chopping logs right now. Until we get down to that, that's probably all you're going to do. Well, I guess I could move one of you up a bit. Something like that. In fact, we can do that and that. Does that help get you guys doing anything? No, if I were to take you all the way to there, what would it do? I'm worried about messing up that one. Um, run, working, there, chopping a tree. So, hmm, yeah, so they've, it, it's only the very first part of the list that they're willing to, uh, to pay attention. I'd really want these guys in here because I want those two orchards worked on next. That's these guys over here. So how do I, I guess I just have to be very careful and all the, no, not all the stuff's brought to it. I guess we'll have to remember to come back to it. Yeah. Anyway, um, what else? It was brought up that my confusion about the carts are that there are mining carts, which looks like a wheelbarrow, compared to a carting cart which looks like that and that's why they I couldn't grab one from somewhere else and drop it into there okay there is a little bit of a difference there you guys are mining limestone and mining limestone there you go I could try 
and sending one of them... Boy, it's a long trip, though, until that bridge is done. Yeah, once the bridge is done, then I might enable... Well, no, they can't take the bridge anyway until that bridge is done. They've got to walk around. Yeah, they have made a... a uh, they've worn a pathway through the woods, I see. So... They're, they're doing it. So this cart here is, is a wheelbarrow. Interesting. Now, what was with the 9,000 or 8,000 I saw them bring back? Did I see... What is stored here? There's only 2,400 stored here. And reserve is 200. Somebody's taken 200 to put it into here. Unfortunately. So, we are doing this thing. Well, let's watch this. What are you actually doing? So you came to get 200 to go put into here, and then you're going to leave. Eh, that's what I was worried about. Okay. So let's shut that down right now. Um, yeah, we'll do that. When this gets full, then maybe, or maybe by the time this gets full, this will be up and running. We'll just be dumping into there. So we'll leave that off. And you as well will leave off. Okay. All right. So what else came up in the comments? Although I'm noticing that our fields are being sowed right now. And also all of our new uh, charcoals are being filled and are full of charcoal. And everything seems to be functioning just fine right now. So plenty of laborers in the system. And... Yet there's still enough work out there for them to not worry about anybody going broke. So plowing this one now, plowing this one, and then we'll be done with plowing for the year. This was at 46, now we're at 48, so it's going to continue to grow. We'll see if it hits hundreds when it gets there. Otherwise, what's up? Um, so we're building this, theoretically. Supplying resources, supplying resources. You guys will also be supplying resources at your various jobs, whether they are... Hmm... Where is... Somebody came from over here. Are you guys dropping off... You're dropping off goods already. There's 19 trees to go, and they're dropping off goods. <laughs> so where are you guys officially working? Are you still... You are chopping a tree, and you are heading over here. Okay, well, it's happening. Okay. Uh, you left most likely disappointed. And there may have been a message up there I didn't see. Uh, right there. Earned $10 on clothes. <laughs> yeah, okay. March is about finished. The sewing is... Well, it's getting done by an army. And they're going to wipe that out real quick. You have been sown. So we have enough extra people now. I'm kind of thinking maybe it's time to pull back on some of this. Let the builders... We'll do six on season and four off season. Keep the... In fact, maybe we'll just... Tell you what, for now, let's just leave it at six and see if the, uh, if the farms suffer from that. I doubt they will. So that will keep the building process continuing. Um, how are we out over in this area now? We still have flax in the system, or are we pretty much running dry? Um, wheat, and that is it. Down in here, there's nothing. No, so we're pretty much done over here. So let's, at the very least, take you down to one. And pretty soon that's going to be gone to textile orchards completed. Okay, so textiles down to five, which means that's going to come to a halt, except there is textile in here. Okay, and there's broadcloth. We're still waiting for the, oh, the one city to trade with us that has the sheep skins. Um, warehouses. I'm wondering if I want a place to dump things like, in fact, whatever happened down here? So the 200 came in, we're calling for 200 more. Let's turn you off. And let's store up here so we can see what is actually stored within the town. So clothes, 
Not seeing you. Right there, clothes. Let's put 1,000 clothes. 1,000 shoes. And 1,000 warm clothes. We'll let them store down here. Then when we hit the trader, we'll be able to see what is within the town storage at that point. Okay, so long term, I think that's a better solution there. So, shoes, we're making another 100. We've got 200 we're taking out. These ladies are just going like crazy. There's 550 there. There's nothing stored here. That's bark, lime, and salt for this guy. And salt, I believe, for this one. Okay, and there's no leather in here, but there's a lot of shoes in here. Okay. So shoes will eventually get stored over there and then brought down here as needed, right? I think so. Then we may leave this line here for, for now. We actually have a money problem for the first time. New family and ran out of funds. They've got 750 coming in. So they've got somebody doing labor work as well. Okay, so... Let's help them out once, and we'll call that good. They're probably going to be fine. They're one of the newest houses to come in. They most likely didn't sell off crops. They don't have a... They've only got two crops available. And maybe they didn't have enough to actually sell to us. But they do have three wage earners now, so they should be fine. That's only this much coming out. Yeah, they'll be, they'll be good. Okay, so what else? Saltworks, how are you doing? Looks like everything's working the way it's supposed to. How is... I just noticed the, the oxen there. What do we have in the way of bulls right now? Four-year-old bull that we could ox if we wanted to. Um, otherwise, we have a one-year-old bull. Okay. So, we've got the makings of a second cow shed if we want it. Tell me, do multiple cow sheds dump into the same field? I don't know that. Or do you, does each cow shed need its own fallow field? I'm going to make the guess that sheep and cows do not share a field, but maybe multiple cow sheds do. I don't know. Um, let's see. So, over here. No, we're over here. We actually, where am I? We're over here. There we go. So, when do we want to plant this? We're in April. Let's start the pattern. First of all, we'll set you to cherries. Let's set the pattern for all of our um, perishable stalls to get set for enable hiring and taking July off like we used to. Not perishables. Never mind. It's the unperishables. There we go. So you guys can do that. Unfortunately, I have to do this manually. You are perishable. You are not. And just kind of get them set to be able to start working in the uh, in the orchards. And maybe just these two. These these the two down here that are available. Because these are going to be really small orchards. So one person should be able to do this just fine. Okay. So that's two people who are going to be fired at the same time. That these are going to be hired at let's reverse that july off season one rather than uncheck all those okay and we will continue to say just women all right so that should work out fine you're next you are you got lost because we're trying to get trees taken down yeah so I think we'll do that, and we'll just see how that goes. All right. What else is on the to-do list for today? Just kind of checking up on things, making sure everything is functioning the way it's supposed to. Granary, I have had a person in here, not knowing if it's absolutely necessary or not, but it does create a wage, and as we've seen, that, that is important that there are wages out here. It's the only granary we have right now. So I think I'm going to leave that. What do you set as? You're just here all the time. So we don't even need 
seasonal hiring to make that work. And we've got our 500 salt now. We've got uh, waiting for more flour. I guess we're we're still sending flour to the market stalls about as fast as we can make it. And we are quite ahead on flour. I could set another windmill. Though I'm not convinced that that's the, the best place. I mean, like it could be. I mean, it's not that far of a, of a cart ride back and forth. Farm to windmill to granary to trader or to market stalls. Yeah, I guess so. You're empty, so we can make you go away. And yeah, let's go ahead and do it here. So copy you and drop you into a place like that. Do I like it? I really don't. It looks weird having them against the trees. It's just not how they're supposed to work. So let's pull out both of you. Give me some more flexibility and try that again. You want the wind to come in. And trees will block all that. So these should almost be set a little bit deeper down into here. Um, any problem with that? I don't think so. I think that's going to be kind of a permanent pathway now. Unless I lengthen this fence a little bit. You know, I could. I can bring the fence all the way up to where I'm setting this windmill. So if you went here. About like that. And... Let's move you sooner than later, at least up to there. And then let's take this fence and delete you. And new fence, your fence number five. Grab there. And do what? So if we take the, the road straight through these archways, we kind of land more into this area. But where does it swing this way? What it, what's going to happen in this little area? That could be another gazebo meeting area. I could. That right there makes us parallel with the other buildings south of us here. Let's go with that. That will push the trail a little bit further this way. And we'll have to come up with something that, that works well in there. And I did not care for these trees out in front. So, let's just... Well, I don't know if I can. I'll lose the bushes, too. Well, I could do it this way. I Actually, I could do something entirely different. I could do... Birdhouses. Right there. And then, if I forget all about the birdhouses, it's not that big of a deal. Because you won't really see them anyway. <laughs> Those four will come out. We've got these here. We've got these here. Might even take these out and put a nice evergreen, a nice spruce or something in here. Something that that allows just these guys to be on the ends like they were intended to be that way. Looks a little random at the moment and a little odd. So let's check up on our wells. Okay, we altered wells last time because we found that we were starting to go dry. You are a little better than last time, but still not maxed out. You're in great shape. We added you. You're still fine. And we added you. Okay. So nothing is getting close to dry. You're available for the chickens. You're eventually available for, for the tannery. All right. We're good there. Um, you needed water. And you're doing... Well, we're not using you. So that's not fair. Um, this one for the cows. We're good there. Okay. So I'd say water-wise, we're in good shape right now. Um, Food-wise, close to our 1,500, 1,500. Our quantities are maxed out over there. Okay, cattle, we've got plenty of water and food. Okay, uh, field, or, yeah, I don't see any problem with hitting our 100% all the way across. Okay... So, how are we doing otherwise? We are working on the orchard. And that one's going to finish here in just a moment. We will take these settings and just broadcast them across. Apply to all. Good. And you guys are hitting out to the limeworks, which is done. Good. So, this now is the, I assume, the project for this forestry over here as far as taking down trees. So, anybody out over here? 
You are going to work getting log... Uh, waiting for a partner. Okay. Which way are you guys heading down? Taking a rest. Never mind. Going to work. Everybody's taking a rest. What are you guys doing? Just working. So I think we are done with these guys. I think we're out of jobs. Um, if I moved these up closer, would these guys take them? They're all just taking a rest now. No way to test that. Okay. Construction of a birdhouse. Someone else is doing it. Yeah, these guys are doing it. Okay. Then I would say it's time to pull these guys out of here and just put them on maintenance mode again. They're not going to be doing any more logging. So, yeah, the other guys are doing it. So, how best to do that? Um, on season, I guess just down to one, and I guess we'll take these guys down to one as well. Um, no, off season is off now. Yeah, you guys can just work on other projects around the place. Okay, now I did pull all these other ones out. That's right. So let's quickly set up another one of these somewhere if it's possible. Nope, can't get one in there at all. We'll put one in here until we know what we're going to do with that space. Okay. All right, so we're over here now. This one I really wanted done first, but we all kind of got out of order. So let's set you there and make sure that the reserved. Oh, that's Limeworks. I thought I was over here wondering who's taking the wood out of there. Um, I'm waiting for 200. Okay. So are you guys going to go jump over there? We have a cart coming back. He came from here for some reason. You've got stone. You grab stone out of the, the trader to take it over here. Okay. And as the rest of these guys come to work, hopefully they will do the same thing and haul all the stone over. And as soon as you're done with that, drop into this. We should be able to see this starting to work this episode. So after that is all up and running, what does it take to make a barber surgery? And oh, that's right. While I'm out over here, there was a question about the second building in the government tab. That is a construction office. What is that? Build construction office in other parts of the town to hire additional builders locally and speed up construction projects. I see. So it's not something that just takes the place of this. It's really an extension of this. For when we're over there. And we want those guys to be hired to work on projects over there. Since we can't move the town hall. That's my guess as to what that's all about. All right. You are up and running. You need lime. And... Well, essentially, we could... We do have lime in the system. It's being stored way up there. Right? Let's see here. Is that what is being stored right over here? Lime. 300 that we had bought. Okay. Because you will use lime. Okay, batch size, and I'm not doing any slaughtering, so the slaughterhouse is turned off. So there won't be any tanning either. So we don't have to worry about that. Now if I, hmm. So I need you guys to make lime, right? But now you're going to make quick lime. The kiln, quick lime is used in lime works. So you are the end product. You are the lime. Okay, so this doesn't take lime. It takes quick lime, which we have none until this is built. Okay. Um, all the materials are, are collected, so we're almost going to see this done here in a moment. Then we will drop into this one next. And I guess while I'm thinking about it, I could go and take all these birdhouses down. Eh, we'll leave them. They're fine. They're all aimed in the wrong direction, but they're fine. But that... Well, we still can't see. <laughs> there. There's our town hall. Okay. So, yep. Yeah, I think these will come down in a, a spruce or a couple of pines or something else will go in there. Speaking of pines, seems like I planted some. Those are spruce. thought I put pines somewhere just to see the, the difference. Now I can't think of where I was when I did that. 
Um, that's a spruce. Lime kiln is done. All right, let's slow down and think about this one. So you are going to take three rounds of charcoal and three rounds of lime at 5,000 each and 3,000 each. And we already don't have enough to do the first round. So it's time to bring you up to full speed. Do I keep you there? We're five and zero. I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll play that one by ear. But it is time to get the lime coming in at a faster rate. You guys, we've got laborers. Oh, that's right. This is by laborer only. Yeah. So, not by hand. That's going to take forever. Although, it's just from here to there. So, in that case, I guess it could be. Though, I'd hate for you to come all the way down here and do it once and then leave. Alright, so I've talked myself out of it again. Um, by cart or by wagon and by cart. But not by hand. Not all the way down here to make one little, you know, toss them in and then run back. No. So, you're there. Um, hire anyone? Yep, anyone. Uh, there's no limits to choose. And we now need 3,000 charcoal. So we need to get somebody, you? No. To come over, either bring the charcoal with them or head over here and get the 9175. Thousand is reserved to come out of there. And now we should find this thousand over here, I'm guessing, get reserved soon and get hauled out of here because now there's going to be a lot of demand for a thousand at a time to start filling that guy up. So I would, I would imagine these guys would get the order to grab that unless they're going to be too busy supplying for construction. And there's a lot of construction to supply for. Okay, so that's up and going. You guys are building this guy next to either store lime or additional charcoal. I'm not sure which. We'll kind of feel that out as we go. Um, speed you back up. We're into May. So in July, both of these are set to trigger with seasonal hiring. And you will fill up and get these planted. And then two years from now, you will... Mm, you know, I probably should do that one month early so it doesn't trigger two years halfway through july yeah let's temporarily get these going right right now uh one's enough and right there and you are going to be apricot all right so let's get these two filled right now with whoever's available and i'm pretty sure there's a a lady or two in here that that needs a job perfect and they'll get them planted long before July happens. So that two years from now, we hit July. It isn't, you know, still waiting to trigger. Although we're still going to be an extra year because they will only then begin to blossom. So I guess no matter how I, I look at this, it's going to fail. <laughs> but she's busy over here planting away, getting these, uh, these trees in. And she'll be done within a week or so. Same as over here. Not a lot of plants over here. A lot of trees over here. In fact, it kind of laid out odd. Couldn't get the, the other one in there. But there'll be enough in here to give some nice food variety in a couple of years. This is the one that's going to actually give us the, uh, the majority of the, the fruit. And probably wouldn't hurt to put a third one in at some point. So we'll maybe leave this, this next space available. Otherwise, we're going to have a road coming across here. Um, you know, I could lay that out just to give us a footprint. Let's do that. So, orchard, drop you into here, spin you around, something like that. F1. So, you're going to drop into there. You're up in here. And you, probably down like so. Yeah, something like that. And then you do what? You have to come back. Where do we want the road? Balaklia, you were just here. I thought you uh, were quite disappointed. So that's as long as I can make it. And where do I want that road to pop out? I guess something like that. Sure. You're going to be... Oh, come on. Right there. You're going to be right there. You spin you around and something along those lines okay so enter 
and you can stay at the end. You're not that big of a of a priority at the moment. Balaklia came in and I'm running fast and they don't wait long. So right there, 19 days left. Um, cows, pigs, iron, horse, lime, charcoal, nails, there's... Let's buy the stone. Yeah, we'll do that. Deal. We're at 1260 up there. To sell. Nope. Potatoes. Um, apparently we did not do a potato crop last time. Now, if the potatoes are sitting in here, will it count? They're not in there. And we are not calling them for, call, calling for them here. So we don't have potatoes in the system. All right. So there and sunflower oil. There's 350 in town storage. And I'm going to leave it that way. That The stuff doesn't expire, right? I'm pretty sure it does not. Uh, right there. Yeah, no bar. So let's just hang on to that. Next. Silo. Close. Yeah, they're never going to trust us again. And we actually don't have that much right now. Because we're running out of textiles. Until we get into our uh, our August and get the, the flax harvested. So textile, leather, don't want to sell any. Horse tack and honey. So we're, we're done. Okay, Balaklia, except for the stone, no thank you. And get that going again. Um, you are this one, only seven logs left. Otherwise, we should be working over here. And they are this time. Interesting. Other times I've seen it that if there was a tree there, they just, everything came to a halt. But they are continuing to work. Good. That is quite the bridge. Did not want to build on this lowland. Though I don't... Hmm. I probably could have. It just would have bumped uphill a lot more, starting so much lower. But that'll be fine. So you're going in, then you're going in. Then we can start playing around with what happens after that. Any kind of infinite, okay. Any kind of a of a scoring system on this guy as compared to a well, which tells you how many how many we'll say gallons is available yet. Alright, so you are fourteen hundred. Now do we know how many layers? I'm assuming that's the first layer. So we're still working on that. Laborers, so we did determine what to bring in except for people. I guess we could try it just to see what happens. It didn't immediately trigger anything. Yeah, it did. So 400's on its way. Just from, well, from two of them. There's 800. So they're able to do 400 at a time. Are they able to cart? No, you're walking over, and so are you. So let's just watch this and see how it works. So I assume you're going to grab it from here. <clears throat> yep, right there. Slow down. You're going to come up the stairs. You are this one. Going to pour it in. Don't fall. And then you're going to... You're done. So yes, yeah, it's, it's a long walk for them to make one run at it. That's a shame. That's why, but the, the carters are busy doing lots of other things, and they may or may not ever, ever get here. So, do we do the long haul? Now, where do you actually live? So, you are that one, and you live over here. So, once this bridge is done, maybe this won't be quite so cumbersome. Yeah. All right. We'll, we'll leave it as is. That way, at least it gets done. Um, what else? Where am I, by the way? About a half hour in. Okay. Um, so, trading is done. Speed you back up again. Working on bridges. You are at windmill, so you'll be going in soon. Actually, you can be next. This other bridge just gets us to the 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 iron that's really all it's, that it's good for. We need the other one to get to the stone. So you could kick back into here ways. We're not going to be doing iron for a while. So I've just watched everything start to to uh, uh, phase in here as far as the planting goes. And we still have this line like we did last year. I don't know what that is. 
why that is this is greener than that interesting um so after this i kind of want to start playing with this area here now we're still building this area here which would be supplying the labor for i guess this maybe the mining barber surgery i want to get the barber surgery in before the mining and i don't know where to put that unless we don't that's right i started to look at this then i switched over to the the construction office okay so you actually are kind of a building all of your own so these houses some of them I don't know, they, they look like they're a complete building. You can see the, the gable on the end. And those without look like they could join together a lot easier. So Barber Surgery is a two-story version of that with ends. And trim work on the ends. So you could just sit in town somewhere. You don't have to be part of a row house. In fact, you look really good right there. Um, spin you around. Yeah, you would work. Um, we could almost do something like that instead of the idea of a mayor's house. Except it's a long way to go from an injury that might happen all the way over here. So there is that. How do we make this look good out here? Are you part of something else that happens here? I don't know. If we started row housing out here, we've got to have another market system out here. So when that happens, we've got to essentially start creating a new source completely. All the things that are planted in the yards, the the flower, you know, the whole works has got to make its way out to this part of the map. We could try to transport by forcing these small granaries to go and steal from there and these to steal from them and try to chain our way down the, the map. Or we just create another whole set of everything out over here. Hmm. It's, it does get hard to move things around afterward. So these guys are here. You're going to be a market. You're going to be probably a farm complex. Sheep. And maybe another more fishing and what have you. I think I don't think we're ready to get into here yet. I just don't think the support system is there. So where do you put something like this? And I don't really have to place it today, so could just leave it here to think about. Um, these don't have to stay. It'd be convenient if they did, but they don't have to. Could you fit in here? Here's an idea. If I rotate you around, the uneven never goes away. Despite that being in the in the way. If I spin you around the other way. No, so that never happens. And it, it'll never happen this way. It's got to be with the slope. So that's not a possibility. It'd look weird down here, even if it did fit. And it's going to look down here, weird down here in the mud, too. Yeah. Hmm. Getting over here, I think, is too far away. I want it available for these guys. And for these guys. And it may... I don't... I've never used one before, so it may have to do with just general sickness and health, too. So it could be the town folk would want to uh, get access to it. Uh, wooden bridge is done. So take you to the curve of the hill. I am not getting a spot in here anywhere that will accept it. It's all uneven terrain. Oh, there was a spot right there. So there's a spot there. Oops. Rotate you like so. Next to a house. Aiming the wrong direction. Could spin you around. You can get into there. Well, I suppose that wouldn't be too strange. Definitely be a statement piece. Almost like you need to be out here like the school was. 
Hmm. So if I were to rotate you more like this. So place is occupied. That's probably a bench or something. Uh, one mill is complete. Slow down so I can think. That actually might look pretty good. Okay, so we'll come back to that. Um, one mill's in. Let's get you employed. So we'll take your settings and just duplicate you. And over here, same thing. Okay, so you are now... That didn't work. Uh, apply to all. We're not seasonal hiring. That's why it didn't work. Okay. So, in that case, we just hire two guys. There we go. Alright, so that's good. Wheat's going to get brought over. Now we're going to be processing two different places. We've got our next bridge going in. <clears throat> or in. Okay. That is some bridge. It's, it's flood proof. That's what it is. Too bad the river doesn't change with the seasons. Spring, it'd be nice if it came all the way up to the top of the mud. And summer came all the way down to the bottom. That would be cool. Then you have to be careful how you build things. They have to be on stilts to, to be able to handle this area. Yeah. Um, what was I... Oh, um, so with the bridge, we're going to have a, maybe a little bit easier way for these ladies to come in from here. Although that might be a longer trip. All the way here to there or across to there. I bet you within... Within feet, this is probably still a shorter trip. Maybe so. This bridge may not get any use until we start using this area. Okay. Well, it looks good. <laughs> so, up in here, you are almost ready. Otherwise, we're moving to the house. We are. We're moving to the house. So, what's after the house? I guess just more houses. Yeah, let's bring in three. So, that's... You, you, and you. All right, we get those going. Though, there really aren't that many extra jobs out here yet for them. So I might just leave you guys off to the end as well. And start thinking about laying out houses in here. And getting ready for our next expansion. That might be so. We might... Any... Unemployed. There's an unemployed lady... And she right now is in the woods. So she maybe was doing some temporary work with a charcoal or something. Unemployed. Cow shed. Unemployed. Laborer. 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 And market stall. Okay. So we are... Yeah, I'm going to push more houses out. So you are the one we're working on. You guys can all go back into there. So we need to come up with some other construction projects. Okay. So next 15 minutes. I'm going to keep the speed slow so I don't get too many interruptions like that. And let's, uh, let's lay some buildings out for next time. Trading post, Dirkachi. We haven't had you in for quite some time. You, we sell a crazy amount of charcoal. And you are the one that boosts our, our budget, our, our treasury up the most. You can only handle 11.3. Okay. So, and I'll bet you as fast, because they're going to haul it out 1,000 at a time. So by the time 10 carts arrive, by the time... 12 carts arrive, two more thousand will have been brought in. So I can go ahead and sell the whole thing deal and not have to change anything because it's still a 10,000 line item. So there'll be at least two more in by the time the 11th and 12th cart arrives. Okay, roadmap. So that is for sale. To buy leather, all of it. Yeah deal. That was scary. So buy all their leather, sell all the charcoal. Alright, anything else to buy? We've ignored iron the last couple of times because I'm pretty sure we're fine. Yeah, there's 700. Okay, so iron is fine. Um, animals, buy flour, buy dried, buy potatoes. None of those are needed. 
Um, I could bring in something like sallow as just a food variety. Could do that, though I'd have to right now. Still have 12 days left. Um, let's do that. Let's bring in... I bet you we could absorb like 400 real quick. Two different places would grab 100 each, and I bet you they would sell out pretty quick. Yeah, let's do that. Deal, buy sallow, and let's set somebody right now to do it. So someone in a place where things um, decay, and that would be this one. So honey shouldn't be in here. This decays, that decays. Apricots decay. We're not going to have those for a long time. So let's set you up. Sallow is here. What's interesting, these list everything. You don't have to click the little check. We have no sallow. Well, I say we have no sallow in the system. It's possible some of these very last houses could have brought some in, and that way it actually is in the system. I guess that's possible. Take me a while to search them down. But you... Yeah, you're, you're angry. I'll leave you alone. Um, and another one over here. So you, uh, chicken fish, cucumber. There might be cucumbers soon. There won't be any apricots. So we'll go ahead and just do that here too. So sallow is going to get into the market. And we'll be able to offer a different food variety. Okay, back to here and world map. So that is it as far as purchasing. So, selling them shoes, there's 1,400 available. Um, actually, that's sitting in here. There's another 1,500. Wow. Let's do the 1,450 right there. And, wow, 464 coming in. Deal. So, all that can go away. Buckwheat, charcoal, um, sunflower oil, nope. Clothes, probably not. Honey, uh, apples, okay, we're done. So, coming in, um, exporting almost a thousand, yeah, a little over a thousand actually. So, that's 22, and though we did buy 500, and then, yeah, so 600 is going back out, okay. But we're going to be sitting really good treasury wise after that. All right, so roads are going to come across through here and over and pop out maybe an archway right here into something. Something could be a market. I kind of like the uh, the circled wagon thing. I think that might be uh, our calling card here. I kind of like the look of that. Though that takes a while to set up. Almost hmm, easier for me to set up off camera like I did that one but so that is a possibility there and there and then out of there a road that kind of works its way across too bad I can't set farm fields ahead of time I have to associate them with a farm can I disassociate one afterward curious I don't want to do it but link to another farm or cow shed but I can't just break the link. Do not plow. Go to farm and deactivate. Okay. I'd like to lay them out to figure out where I want to put the farm building itself. Leaving the best land available for, for the farm fields. This little bump right here, if I swing it around, that's where the fields need to be. That's almost impossible to build right through there. And... We look fairly even, but there's another one right there. So there's your path. Kind of a darker area there, and comes right through here. That's the, the quick change in elevation that the farm fields need to be part of. Okay. That will be hard to build other buildings. So do we want to set... Let's set the, the shoreline buildings first. <clears throat> so we don't lose the ability to do that. You are here and there, yeah, fulling mill comes in over here somewhere. So you've got a couple of anchor points and a pathway in. You could be most anywhere. Really what you need is the pathway to get there. 
So where's the pathway going to be? Probably in between two fields. Which then I go right back to, I wish I could set the farm fields first. So I know where they're going to be. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's just play with that idea. Add a field. And... <clears throat> Maybe between now and next March, I can have the farm building built and I'm reassociated. Okay, so I would want some space from the shore. And we'll say 40... F no, there's our, our incline right there. Hmm. Yeah. So that's not going to work. Now, the, that means the farm needs to be up here. Okay. Um, maybe we can start with that then. So the farm is there and probably aim down. If we can... No, we can't. So in that case, it's going to be aimed like so. I think. So road's over here. Road kind of pops out. I don't know. Well, I have laid this out two or three times now and not like what I've done and deleted it. And I'm going to just work on that in between episodes where I can sit down and really think about it without needing to talk about what I'm thinking about because it's taking forever. These guys are already mostly through the harvest while I was trying to fight my way through all of that. So I'm going to just ignore that for the moment. I'll lay some things out before next episode and show you what I came up with but right now I really don't know what I want over there and whatever I do it doesn't look right so simplest way is to say it'll it'll magically appear next time or things will get too busy around here and they won't appear next time <laughs> and we'll fight it off next time um still odd that it's green here and not there so what is that all about I don't know. Um, over here, how are we doing? We are filling it up with, I'm going to say, the next round, because that's awfully deep. So that must be round two. 2,800 left, 200 at a time, and it's mostly happening by ladies. The guys are not getting their butts over here. Yep, so I think that's just a thing. You are being worked on next, but we're in August. Oh, that's right. Full building crew now not so we did not take them off to work on the harvest we didn't fill our whole roster as a result we're still going to get everything in and they don't continue to grow do they i don't think so i think once august first hits this bar just dies which is a shame you'd think that well, not with something that dries out like that, but some of these other ones, you'd think that they would just continue to, to grow while they're still taking these out. I mean, they're still green. They're still, there's still life happening there. So you, I guess if I were to spend a season with my mouse right there to see if that moved any further, but I don't think it does. I think it's a, well, I just move a pixel. You have to tell me if it does or not. I don't want to spend too much of the episode f trying to figure it out. But we're pretty much done with the harvest still, even with everybody still working. Okay, I completed this orchard. So you... Um, same sort of thing as these guys. Um, let's just apply to all. Though this one is going to be a much larger group of folks. So, of ladies. So, this one is going to be July. Uh, that's right. i got to go un unhire all of them. But you're going to be probably more like three. Time we really get it up and going. Um, you guys need to be... Actually, for now, let's just... Off-season. And there... No, it was the opposite. And apply to all. We're planted. We're done. This... I'll manually put somebody in here to make apples and get those planted for next year. And one, August. There might be a deadline on when we can do the planting. So I 
Yeah, let's get two in to make sure that happens. Even three. They're all going to come off of of this other... Um, doing this work and need a place to work. Okay. Um, who are you? You're charcoal. So charcoal, are you the first of the charcoal? Anybody working right now? You're coming to work. You're coming in. You're going to work. So all these folks that are supplying resources are probably going to drop them off and leave, aren't they? Let's speed you up and find out. You going to work in the wagon or are you going to just go away? Is anybody going to fill the wagon up? Oh, you came with leather. Okay, unloading you. Good stuff. But charcoal has or has not been happening. 9,000, so one card is left. I'm waiting to see if the other 2,000 is going to come on its own. So you are being... You're, we're selling you shoes. You, we are what? Selling you charcoal. Okay, so two have left and none are on their way back in. Uh, we have a marriage. Moved into a house that just finished. Which is another reason to enable another couple of houses. Yeah, there is that. Let's go ahead and put these two back in. We probably have several young families needing a home. So, for them. Alright, so still nothing being triggered to bring in. And they could all be arriving kind of at the same time. So I'm going to have to make this happen. Um, is there charcoal sitting in here? There's not. There's 5,000 of each of those. There is charcoal sitting here. There's supposed to be. And there's 800 reserved to go somewhere. Um, not there. Oh, right there. 800. 800. So someone's going to quickly move these across. Um, let's call for a 2,000 real quickly to be brought by Carter Charcoal 2,000 to here just to make sure it happens and there it is okay so that one is going to be done no matter what and it was being asked to be done while all this was happening so probably you know, the timing was bad. You know, those who would have done it were all busy doing other things. We'll, we'll go with that. Otherwise, we are planting this up great. That's going to be done here real soon. And you guys are complaining because... Oh, we're actually down on logs. You converted everything to charcoal. Weird. Okay. I've not seen you guys do that. And... Bar Barvinkove, you are the one that sells us the sheepskin. Yes. So right there. And we'll take... It took us a long time to get back to you again, so I was going to do the 300 to match the other. I think we will double that and go 600. And... Yeah, let's do that, and we'll get a bunch more of the broadcloth later. So 600 from you instead. Deal. And I did buy it, right? Not sell it? Good. <laughs> so buying. Lime. Turn you back on. Um, buying glaze. All right. What is glaze? That's what I was thinking of when I was trying to figure out what sand was, not knowing what the glaze looked like. Glaze is used where... Um, to build a fancy house, you use glass. Okay, so that's not it. So glaze is used... I'm not sure. Would it be wise to get some in stock? Maybe so. Let's... we're not selling anything to you guys. So glaze, let's bring in at 10... Cents each. Let's bring in 1,000. Let us sit in there till we figure out what to do with it. Because we're not going to be making it for a while. I'm not even sure how to make it. Wool, sheepskin, buckwheat. And we should still be great with buckwheat in town. I think we're fine there. Uh, we may have just harvested some, right? I don't know what we... Uh, right there. Yeah, we're fine on buckwheat. Okay. So, one more time. World map. 
lime, iron, iron ore, glaze, wool, sheepskin, buckwheat, and selling none of these. Okay, that's it. We're we've got only 250 leaving. Okay, um, more glass. World map. Were you the glass one? You're not the glass one. Okay, it's the other one. All right, so that is done, and I think I am done. I have done so much of the episode that I'm going to cut out because it just didn't work. I don't no idea where I'm at. It says I've been at it for an hour 15. So what that actually is, I'm not sure. Um, quick little glance around just to see everything. We're on our second of three layers of the limestone now. So next time we should see that complete. Um, nothing else here. You're about to be all fired. Working on cutting those down. Otherwise, we're looking at getting a couple more houses done. Chickens are fine. Cows are fine. This probably goes away. I think so. Demolish. Get this back so we can... Oh, barber surgery. So, I'll take another look at the barber surgery. And if you guys have a special place for it. I think it might compete too much with this building to put it here. So, I really do think it is somewhere in this space. But give me your thoughts on that. I won't. Uh, it won't be a permanent structure by the time I start next episode. So in between episodes, give me your thoughts on the barber surgery. We can build it, right? I didn't really look that close. Uh, sand, lime. I think that's what that is. Bricks, nails. Yeah, we've got everything, or can get everything. Yeah, we're fine there. And I suppose. I could turn this on for 1,000 stone. Maybe next time we'll we'll notice some of them making the, the death march out there. What I call the death march. I think they'll be fine. I'm just used to banished, and that's always a worrisome thing. You're the family they had trouble last time. You have no income right now. You're all unemployed. So maybe we will start here next time and figure out what's going on. So thanks for watching, folks, and I'll catch you later. Bye-bye now.